an old Bailey court in the United Kingdom has found former Deputy Senate President Ike Ekwerimadu and wife Beatrice guilty of organ trafficking. The duo, alongside a medical doctor, Dr. Obina Obeta, were found guilty of facilitating the travel of a young man to Britain with a view to his exploitation after a six-week trial. The jury found on Thursday, March 23, that they criminally conspired to bring the 21-year-old Lagos Street trader to London to exploit him for his kidney for Ekwerimadu's sick daughter, Sonia. They were convicted in the first verdict of its kind under the Modern Slavery Act. The court heard that the man, who cannot be named for legal reasons, was offered an illegal reward to become a donor for Ekwerimadu's daughter after kidney disease forced her to drop out of a master's degree in film at Newcastle University. In February 2022, Ekwerimadu was said to have falsely presented the man to a private renal unit at Royal Free Hospital in London as Sonia's cousin in a failed attempt to persuade medics to carry out an £80,000 transplant. For a fee, a medical secretary at the hospital acted as an Igbo translator between the man and the doctors to help try to convince them he was an altruistic donor, the court heard. The prosecutor, Hugh Davies, told the court that the Ekwerimadus and Obeta had treated the man and other potential donors as disposable assets, spare parts for reward. He said they entered an emotionally cold commercial transaction with the man. Ekwerimadu, wife, and Obeta had all pleaded not guilty. Sonia did not give evidence and was not found guilty. Justice Jeremy Johnson will pass a sentence at a later date. <laughs>